Hi guys, this week our theme is all about weather. And Miss Sam and I are also going to incorporate into that learning your addresses, as well as starting to go over and review with some of you numbers, at least numbers one to 10. But today I'm gonna to show you an art project that I thought would be really fun to do because I thought since it's so windy outside today that we could talk about the wind. Now, when I looked outside in my backyard today, not only were the trees blowing like this, but the leaves were all falling off of the trees. When I walked outside to get the mail, my hair went really crazy, started blowing in the wind, right? Even some of my backyard furniture kind of blew over because it wasn't heavy enough to stay. Now the wind is the same idea as if you take your lips, you put them together, and then you blow outwards. That's kind of like what the wind is. And I actually blew over my straw. So the art project that I thought that we would do today would be about wind and the movement of air from one place to another. And what you're going to need is very, very simple. You need one of these, it's a straw. You need some of this, which is paint. And you need a piece of paper. It could be thin paper, it could be construction paper, it could be a cardboard box if you have it. Again, since we're all home and everybody has different materials, it doesn't matter what you have or what you use, we're all just gonna have fun with it, okay? Now, the whole idea of this project, it's not really a standard art project. It's similar to something that's called process art. So that's one of those big words that Miss Jamie and Miss Sam talked to you about. Process art, learning comes from doing and achieving. It's not about what you make. It's the fun of getting there. It's the fun of actually doing it. So I'm gonna show you, here's my blank piece of paper. And I'm just gonna take a little bit of paint and pour it out on my paper. See? Then I'm gonna take my straw and I'm just gonna blow gently into the straw. See what happened to my paint? It moved. Now, if you look at my picture, it kind of looks like a bat, right? But if I want, I could still take my straw and blow some more. Now I did this just by using one color paint, black paint. But if you want, if you have at home, you can take as many different color paints as you have and you can use the same straw, just pour a little bit of another color paint on the paper and then just blow. It's really, it's a lot of fun. Just be careful and what I would suggest that you do is put down a tablecloth underneath your paper so you don't get any paint on mommy and daddy's nice tables, okay? So again, this is called process art. We made art by using wind and all you need are three little things a straw, a piece of paper, and some paint. So don't forget to have fun with it, make lots of really cool pictures, post them in your portfolio on Class Dojo, and if you don't do that, just take a picture of it and send it to me or Miss Sam, because we can't wait to see it, okay? Hope you guys have a great day, and we'll see you tomorrow. Love you, bye.